Hi guys, this is Mila Viram45 and I just received a package from Nanuch 2008. The other day I received a package from her, I think it was on Saturday, and she PM'd me saying that she has sent two small packages, but I just, I had only received one and today I went to the post office and I, I received the other one and she sent me these awesome pieces that she made. Look at this. Definitely, guys, you guys have to go check her site out. She does such amazing stuff, and she embellishes them so well. This is made of polymer clay, and it is oh, beautiful, beautiful. I love this little hand where it says handmade, and I just adore the way she embellishes it. And it is big. It's a fat piece. It's a thick piece. You have to tell me how you do them, how you layer them that you don't notice the the streaks here as of the of the pieces because this this has got to be layered because the pasta machine, unless it's just rolled with the with the rod, the acrylic rod, but it's very thick and it is beautiful. And she made me this heart. This, this isn't a heart. I'm sorry. This is the um, a bow. And it has two colors, two layers. And look how beautiful. I really love it. It's brown and red. This is the real red, red. And this cookie. Look how beautiful. It just gives me oh, the urges to eat one of those sandwich ice creams. <laughs> yeah. Look how beautiful. And it has a little dangle here. I just love the way she does these, her little dangles on, I call them dangles, I don't know if that's the way you say it, I just, I'm used to saying it like that, where she puts these little things, findings down here, and it's really beautiful, I really like that, and this filling is so, looks so, oh my god, it, 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 I just feel like taking a bite out of it, <laughs> it's so beautiful. Thank you so much. And she also sent me, but I had to, you know, I couldn't resist. Look, this bracelet. Look at this. Isn't this awesome? Oh, I love it. I love it. I've always, always wanted to have a bracelet like this. Because I do have bracelets with Pandora beads, but I've always wanted a bracelet with just findings on it. You know, with these little... um. How do you call these things? I don't know. I call them findings. And it is so beautiful. My goodness. Look at this. These pieces are awesome. That, let's see if it'll focus in the, on them. Look at that. They're gold and silver. And look at this. The clamps is beautiful. This, this bracelet is awesome. I, I put it on. I'm not going to take this off. I love it. I just love it. And it's big. You can see. It's big, big pieces. Thank you so much. I love these pieces. I will treasure these pieces. Thank you very, very much. Well, guys, I got to go. I think I'm going to go take a nap for a while because I've been up all these days so early. And I'm really, I feel I'm, I'm like catching a cold or something. I've got a really sore throat and my body aches a lot. Um, so I'm just going to take a little nap, a couple of minutes, maybe an hour at the most. And then I got to go to my shop downstairs, my workshop, and, and do some things. I'm working with um, Jenny B. Craft sent me the other day um, uh, some, uh, how do you call it, cold porcelain. Um, how do you call that, that, that? like a block of cold porcelain she made and I'm trying to get the hang of it that is really I thought it was going to be a little bit easier to work with but it's very soft it loses its shape so quickly it's really really soft and um it, it's it's a lot softer than the Sculpey clay and and it's it's really hard to work with it's really really hard to work with but I'm 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 working with that. <laughs> I'm working with that, and I'm trying to make some ATC cards. I I need to get inspired. <laughs> 
I, I got a million ideas in my head as, as to themes to do, but then I have to like get get all my things together. I've got a bunch of the other day I filmed, uh, and you saw a bunch of magazines on top of my bed. It's me going through the the pages and and trying to cut out some some things because I have a couple of themes in my head. I I just don't know one exact theme because um I I've never worked with it. I don't. Well, I do have stamps. I have a whole bunch of things I can use. I just have to organize, like, okay, I, I want to do, for example, I want to do a theme about Paris. I want to do a theme about vintage cards. I want to make, um, I don't know, I, I've got a whole bunch of ideas, but um, I need to, like, organize everything to to get my, my ideas straight and see what I can do. And it's it's not easy because I've never done that. I had done scrapbooking, wow, when my youngest, no, my second son was born, and that was, he's 15 years old right now. He just turned 15, so it was, it's been like about 14 years. When I did do scrapbooking, it was, it was really simple. I remember it was just your pictures and cutting out some, some punch figures, and, and everything was so simple. And now I see so many embellished things, my God. And I've seen some scrapbook pages that you have a 12 by 12 page and you only have one picture and everything else is, is stamps and, and, and punch outs and things. And it's, you know, it's kind of like a lot. And, you know, I, I, I'm, I'm kind of like overwhelmed with so many things and that I've been seeing so anyways I'm just rambling here and um I don't want to get you guys tired so anyways um here are the pieces again so you could see them up close and personal <laughs> thank you Nanooch they are very awesome I love them and I just love my bracelet so anyway guys I'll see you guys later God bless you and take care see you later bye bye